In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Blogger Pro template. I've had a few questions on how to customize a few things. So in this video, I'm going to cover that. So for those of you that don't know what the Blogger Pro template is, this is a template which you can install on your existing Divi website or a brand new Divi website to create a beautiful looking blog. Now, this is a paid template, so it's only $19, but this will save you a lot of time because it comes in with a beautiful layout. Now, before I get started, I'd like to remind you that if you want to learn how to design professional looking websites with Divi, if you buy it using my affiliate link, I will give you access to my web design formula course, a course that teaches you how to create beautiful looking websites with Divi. All right, so let me show you what this template looks like and how you can customize it further. So right now I've gone ahead and I've installed it. In fact, let me show you what happens when you install it. So you should go to your theme builder. This is where your template is. So you can see here that so there's a lot of designs that have been made to this template. We have the default template. And then we have the 404 page, the search results page, the blog page, the archive pages, the post pages, and the category pages. So pretty much if you're setting up your blog for the first time, you don't need to worry about designing all these yourselves. And this is why I've made it very cheap and also easy to access. So for those of you that want to create a blog really fast, you can just go in and install this. The link to that, by the way, is also in the video description below. So once this is all set, let's take a look at what the website looks like. So I'm just gonna come over here to our posts and then just click on all posts. I just wanna take a look at any post on my website. So over here, I'm just gonna click on view and I'm gonna open this in a new tab. Right, so in this tab, we can see here that this is our main hero area. This is our image. And if we scroll down here, you know, this is the content that you can add to it. You also have a link to the previous post, uh, sign up for a newsletter and also read more. And then finally on the bottom here, we have your comments. So let's say you have an existing website and you don't want this Blogger Pro template to take over your fonts, your colors and so on. Here's what you need to do. So back over here, the very first thing you need to do is to head over to the theme builder. So let's say you don't want to use the, uh, the fonts that come in with um, the Blogger Pro template. All you have to do is to delete this global body. Okay, so once you delete it and save, if you then go to your website, this will maintain your original fonts that you had on your website because that particular template here, the, uh, the global body, takes over the body of your whole website. So if you delete that, then that works fine. Okay, so let's say you've worked hard on your header and uh, you're happy with the header that you had before and uh, you'd like to keep that. Now what happens is when you install the Blogger Pro template, it comes in with its own header. So what you need to do to disable it is to, again, you want to come over here and delete this global header. Now, you'll notice that when I save and come over here to our site and I refresh, this now is just going to show your default header. So this is going to be, oh, in fact, you know what? I need to do the same on the posts. So over here on all posts, you need to delete it there and also on the search results. And pretty much you just need to delete it on all these instances, okay? So once you delete the headers, if you click save, and then you come over here to your site and refresh, you're going to see a standard header that comes in with Divi. And there we go. So that's the normal one. So we're just assuming that this is your main one that you'd have created. But as you can see, we still have this design that we need for our blog. So you still have your opt-ins, you still have all these uh, blog posts which are still stylized beautifully. Look at that. So you still have all that, but your header is now defaulted to the old one. So the same applies uh, with uh, the fonts. If you had a specific font here, this would go because over here, the global body affects you know, all the body of the whole website. So as you can see here, we don't have the global anymore. So any of your normal pages that you have in your website will not be affected. So that's all you need to do. If you don't want the header that comes in with the Blogger Pro template, just delete the header. If you don't like fonts of the template to take over your site, just delete that and you're good. And then finally, I don't know why you would do that, but if you want to delete the footer as well, you can go ahead and delete that. But it keeps everything else intact, which means the layout of your blog here is still going to be the same. You're still going to have all your links over here. The only thing that you need to do is to make sure that you've deleted 
the uh, the right items that you need to delete on your template. So that's all you need to do in order for you to customize this. All right, guys, that's all I have for you in today's video. If you have any more questions about how to use the Blogger Pro template, please let me know in the comments box below so I can update this or make new tutorials. And also, if you'd like to purchase this template, I'll leave a link to that in the video description below. All right, guys, that's all I have for you in today's video. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you again in the next video. Take care.